you know, with all these reports that have occurred over the years, four of them, with these complaints by Alter and uh, uh, Sawia, yeah. and with these court judgments, yeah. how would you respond to suggestions that through all of the above, NERSA yeah. has in fact compromised its role okay. uh, as an independent regular by being too soft on Eskom okay. and not really investigating the issues raised in these reports yeah. and in these uh, cases that I've mentioned. Okay. So, yeah, so this thing of being too soft or hard, I think that doesn't really feature in our consideration is are we being soft or hard on this? It's, it's about, you know, so the Act requires us to make sure they're sustainable, but also to make sure that only prudent and efficient costs, etc., are recovered. But we have to make sure anything that is proven or deemed to be, I suppose, determined to be prudent and efficient is allowed. Um, so, so that's the construct we start from. You know, and, and yes, you have information asymmetry, there's stuff that comes out, but our stuff is around the economics. Um, you know, I, I think some of those reports might talk to, you know, alleged fraudulent activity and all that. I'm really talking about yeah. irregularities and inefficiencies yeah. in yeah. procurement yeah. of diesel yeah. and coal yeah. and other procurement activities. Okay, so that, that, that is, I mean, if they haven't procured efficiently, and uh, if I remember correctly, in the was it the last RCA, we didn't allow them the, the OCGT because we said that was your allowance, you know. Um, and uh, coal is an issue, um, and how they procure, etc. So that will be looked at as we go. Um, you know, so I, I think what we felt is, and, and, and I haven't been involved in all those deliberations, but I have had sight of some of them um, before I took on this role, is there has been this discussion about when ESCOM submits, and, and there's been some really tough deliberations, um, I think if you've seen, I don't think we've ever given them everything they've asked for because of those deliberations. You know, so uh, we've got the actual, and then there's the other one, and I think which is, is 2008, there was a, a, a revision of the, I don't know if it's the regulations or the act that says we have to give ESCOM a return based on replacement value rather than historic depreciated. Uh, I was actually in government at the time, so, so um, and that has, that's also had an impact on increasing the revenue requirement. Um, and I think if you talk from the other side of the fence, what we did realize was that um, because of the escalation in cost of new equipment, if you just depreciate your old equipment, you're not recovering the money to replace. Mm. Um, and actually, that's symptomatic of what we've got now, mm -hmm. is that it was done too late in my view, mm -hmm. which means they didn't recover enough money in the earlier years to replace the new plant, which means that the increases had to be higher. Mm -hmm. So it looks like... We're being soft, I guess, in, in, in the public's terms. Um, but actually, the fact is, it's a decision made on what is required to provide. And yeah, you can have debates about what the provision requirement should be. But given the construct that we're working with, the current IRP, um, you know, the cost that they can prove and how they do it. And yes, in NYPD4, with all these reports coming out, we would have to look at the efficiencies. So that's where we would come in, is to say, well, if these reports are saying they were inefficient, we need to go and look at that and say, well, they presented this cost. So going forward, and they've said this is the cost, is that efficient or isn't it? Mm -hmm. you know? So that's where, where our kind of space would be. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, I guess it's a perspective, right? ESCOM would say we've been very hard on them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Public is saying we've been very soft. Um, you know, and, I, and I think we'll have a discussion about the, 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 the recent, um, de well, not confirmation of the determination, you know. Mm. Is that a hard or soft decision? Mm. I don't know. Mm. So.